Tonight, the owner of a mural off Southwest 2nd and Ash is being told it must come down because it's simply too big. That's even though there are other murals and signs nearby of comparable sizes. Jessica Morkut is there live tonight getting answers on why. Jessica? Well, Kelly, the owner of this mural here tells me ever since someone complained last year, he's been fighting a long and uphill battle just to keep this mural here that was all along just intended to unite the community. You can't spend five minutes out there in that parking lot without seeing a tourist take a picture of it. Got it. Todd Roll tells me the mural on the side of his business off Southwest 2nd and Ash comes from the slogan of Pedal Bike Tours of Portland, a more than 1,600 square foot creation meant to inspire. The whole idea was just it's a, if you put it too small, it, you wouldn't even see it. It would look silly. So we have a giant building. Why not go for it? It'll be big. It'll be beautiful. With his landlord's permission, Roll and his wife had the mural painted here in 2012 and was told a city permit wasn't necessary because the mural falls into a protected category of displays. According to city code, if a sign or mural has ever existed on the building before, then painting over it in the future is okay. And size doesn't matter, much like this Tonkin mural just a few blocks away. We were made to understand that it could be grandfathered in because there had been a sign there previously. But Roll's trouble started in February 2013 when an anonymous person complained about the size of his mural. I'm sad that there's somebody in this city that doesn't like bikes. I found out from the Bureau of Development Services that unless the sign falls under that protected category, the maximum size for a mural on a building like this is 300 square feet. Roll and his landlord believe that they were exempt from that rule. But when they couldn't provide a picture of the previous ad here, there's nothing there to base your grandfather claim on. Uh, so at that, they said that we our next option was to take it down or apply for a permit. So that's when we applied for a permit, and um, once again they said that it was far too large. Now in two days, this mural will come down. Roll says it's hard not to feel singled out or insulted with murals all around the city of a greater size. And back here live now, Roll says he doesn't know who initiated the complaint against him, and he himself is not complaining about any of the other signs in the community like this, but he says this is just all around very disappointing. Per city rules, the sign must be downsized, so you will no longer see the words America's bicycle capital any longer, but you will see uh, the business's logo up above, and that's all. Live in downtown Portland, Jessica Morkert, Coin 6 News.